Light emitting diodes, also known as LEDs, have revolutionized the lighting industry. LED lamps have a lifespan, energy efficiency, and sustainability factor several times greater than traditional lighting and are fast becoming the dominant source of lighting in the world. Since 1983, Torrance, California-based Ledtronics is a world leader and the pioneer of designing, manufacturing, and packaging high-quality, state-of-the-art LED lighting products. Ledtronics and its founder are responsible for giving birth to the LED industry, which is on the verge of evolving into a multi-billion dollar market. Ledtronics offers a wide variety of LED products for industries and customers of all kinds, including 80% of Fortune 500 companies. The company's vast array of products includes LED tube lights, down lights, post tops, canopy fixtures, flood lights, street lights, bay lights, miniature and intermediate bulbs, indicator lights, and thousands more. As Ledtronics business expanded and production increased, the need for efficient manufacturing processes became more and more important. To maintain their dominance in the global marketplace, Ledtronics turned to Hako, a soldering equipment manufacturer for their soldering processes. Chris Stuber from American Hako Products and Tom Cerati from Stratasys Group sat down with Anwar Merchant, Paul Pat, and Simon Song at Ledtronics to discuss how Hako has improved Ledtronics manufacturing processes and help them secure their position in the marketplace as a leading manufacturer of LED lighting. Onward, before Ledtronics converted to the Hako equipment, what systems were you using and why did you make the change? Before Hako, we were using three, four different types of systems. The reason we changed it for quality and consistency was number one. The other reason was tip inventory. The other reason was training issues and maintenance issues. We wanted to have one system that does everything, one platform. And basically, after reviewing several products, Hako was the one we selected um, that fills our need, with, especially with quality and consistency. And I know your product mix has changed. You were using smaller components at one time, and that's changed some. Correct. Can we, you address that a, a little bit? Correct. We used a lot of, um, well, we used to make a lot of small products like the indicator lights in the uh, panels and whatnot. Um, the, the business has evolved into a larger LED lighting luminaires, which means street lights, uh, tube lights, um, area lights, and warehouse lights. And, and, and as such, we needed a larger uh, temperature type of equipment where Hako was perfect as we could get the temperature uh, consistency that we needed for our larger products. Very good. Thank you. Simon, before the company made the conversion to Hako in late 2012, how have the Hako stations helped you in the manufacturing process both here at the Torrance facility and at your offshore facilities? Well, uh, especially uh, with the large size product, which is our TA product line, and street light of line. We improve about 50% uh, soldering time. We're saving that time. And also eliminating a lot of uh, our coal sole and our, therefore our product quality is a lot improved. And uh, also a lot of uh, temperature change from low to high, a lot easier, easier than our other brand name of uh, soldering. So when you made the purchase of the Hako equipment, you bought our FM203 model that allowed you to have a regular solder handle, our FM2027, and then because of the larger components that Anwar mentioned, uh, the heavier duty handle, the FM2030. Mm -hmm. So can you explain a little bit how that's helped with your operators not having to switch handles and having both, both handles available at any given time? Well, we have a two different product line, which is heavy duty type product, and one is a, a small size product line. Uh, we're using uh, both of handles for heavy duty type and uh, our, our regular tips at the same time. Uh, and we, we, we're saving a lot of times on the uh, assembly. Yeah, very good. Yeah. 
fifty percent improvement. Fifty percent improvement is yeah. is quite uh, quite amazing. Yeah, quite amazing. That's very yeah, good. That's good. Thank yeah. you, Paul. When you changed to Hako equipment. Did it take the operators much time to get used to the equipment change from your previous equipment? No, it, it actually not when we changed to a HACO and um, especially um, because of HACO have um, representative that um, came to um, um, to install the, the unit and um, training like three times for our operators so they get um, happy they get the use of them as normal they don't have any issue with the the system yeah. so they're satisfied with the equipment and the performance yeah exactly they very very satisfied with the, the station yeah that's good yeah. Simon we know that it's difficult when a company makes a conversion like this to estimate what the overall cost savings are but one thing we do know is that the tip cost usually improves or is lowered because of the HACO tip life. Can you talk a, a little bit about that with us? Yes, uh, uh, other brand names uh, uh, tips, which is about a one week uh, life cycle, and HACO uh, tips about three to four weeks life cycle. So it's about uh, three times or four times longer. So we're saving a lot of money on the tips costing. Right, so okay. even though you made the upfront cost of all the equipment, the power supplies, mm -hmm. your ROI is going to be uh, fairly, was fairly immediate because of the uh, three to four time tip life. That yes, you, that yes, you yes. So we, we can see the uh, money saving in about, uh, about a month, so we can see ROI is pretty quick. Very good. I do want to point out that with the same amount of um, uh, soldering time, the tip were lasting longer with the same amount of production throughput. Oh, very good. Okay, that's a good point. Yeah. Now that you've been using HACO some time exclusively, would it be fair to say that you'd recommend HACO to other companies that are using hand soldering equipment? Yes, we'll definitely recommend uh, other companies that are using solder equipment, and we're very satisfied with HACO at this point in time. Anwar, finally tell us about electronics the LED marketplace. We're also aware that the owner and the family has contributed much to uh, families around the world. And the challenges that you're now faced with as an organization. Well, Electronics is a pioneer in the LED indicator market. We originally developed an LED indicator light and now it's evolved into, as you see, um, lots of luminaires, street lights and indoor outdoor lights etc um, and this is ready to explode it's going to be in every single homes all the lights and bulbs and leds and we need to uh, continue to capture that kind of market um, as far as global citizenship is concerned um, we um, donate a lot of solar lanterns that are light related with one watt LED bulbs to a lot of villages in, in Pakistan hmm. at this point in time. Um, we have a, um, a um, website called uh, Global Citizenship or gcitizenship.com where you can go and, and further uh, study that and, uh, uh, and give us your comments on that to see if, if uh, it can be improved or if you want to join us with some of these things. Very good. How long has the company been in business? The company has been in business over 32 years uh, and originally started in the owner's garage and is evolved into this with uh, uh, this facility as well as offshore facilities. Uh, quite, it's quite a story. How about the challenges that's now faced the company with competition and lower pricing requirements by the consumer? How are you planning to handle that? That's always a challenge and that's why we're always trying to cut cost to produce things here in the USA as well as offshore so we can compete out in the market and be able to capture the market. Good. And HACO certainly wants to participate in that. We're always looking for ways to lower our cost of acquisition for our customers, improving our tip life, improving our processes, and improving our equipment. And we appreciate that. And more, we really appreciate you inviting us down and share your story with us. Thank you Thank very you. much. Thank you. Thank you. Electronics and HACO. 
a partnership in the soldering manufacturing processes of LED lighting, bringing the future of light to the world today.